just saw, it's de-restricted again, so that's my sign. So hello people, this is Moskavlog and today I have the 2022 BMW M5 competition with me. This is the facelift, the LCI version of the M5 competition that I have. LCI basically stands for facelift, life cycle impulse in BMW language. And let's have a look what has changed. So the complete front bumper has changed. We have um, another intake here. We have a different intake here with this thing here, this bar, we didn't have it. We have completely new BMW laser lights. With, we have the new grill here with a new design. Look at them, how they go. And the M5 competition badge in the grill. Oh. Step going a little bit back to have a look at this M5 competition in L white gray. It looks amazing, really. Just look at this color. It's like gray and in the sun it becomes gold. A nice color combination of this car. So under the hood we still maintain the same 4.4 V8 by turbo. So now that we covered up the front area of this car, let's move down the side. We have amazing carbon ceramic brakes, part of the M track package this car has with these LCI wheels. Uh, you have multiple options for the wheels, but this one is gorgeous, seriously. I, I like it really a lot. The side plates now say M5 competition instead of just M5. Of course, because this is a competition pack, we have the black mirrors, the black side plates, the black grills, um, basically everything blacked out. Also at the back, a lot of black parts. So this car has a really special feature. It has the sunroof. Most of the M5s have a carbon roof stock, so everything here comes in carbon and you have no sunroof. Just look at it. Now we have the painted glass roof here and uh, we can have a look inside. Hello M5. So moving on to the back, we have these super cool new facelifted M5 LCI lights. They give the car a really modern look, even the normal, M uh, even the normal 5 series looks special because of them. M-Town Hamburg badge here, M5 competition badge in black. Competition spoiler also in black because on the normal M5 it's in the same color like the car and we have these thinner exhaust tips than on my 2019 M5 competition. They became a little bit thinner but they still look the, the same basically. They still look the same basically. Just look at these lights. They are so amazing. And now let's jump onto the inside and take it for a drive. We have soft closing doors. We have here the new M5 competition badge. On my M5s in 2019, you only got an M5 badge and this one is also black on mine, it's silver. It's saying M5 competition here, same M5 floor mats like in mine. Full leather package here, carbon, same matte carbon like in mine, Bowers and Wilkins Audio and now let's jump inside. So, on the inside, super cool black full leather package seats. You can tell if it has the full leather package or not by seeing these stitches here. A car and an M5 without the full leather package doesn't have these stitchings here. Um, these black seats, the M5 seats, they are really comfortable and super high quality and really adjustable in every single way. You can adjust this, 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 basically everything. So the M5 in our gauge cluster and the same color like the exterior. The lighting here, Bowser Milkins Alcantara roof, of course. The new steering wheel with these new button setups, but basically still having the same functions. Ceramic applications here, this means that these things are in black ceramic, which looks and feels cool, but they get a lot of fingerprints. The matte carbon here everywhere. So now let's take it on for a drive. Let me turn it on for you so you can hear it. Sounding really really good. The engine button here, the start stop of the engine is here. If you push it to the right, you go into drive or S, which is the manual mode. Like this, you go in neutral just to the left. And to put it into reverse, you have to pull it to the neutral and then to the reverse, like in a manual car, the first gear would be. Yep, and this one is shifting up and down. And these are our shift speeds. We can also configure our dials like this and we can set up the whole car basically. Look, if we get rid of the camera, we press to set up. Now we have the engine, the suspension, 
and the steering and we can just adjust that sport sport plus sport we can put everything like we want it completely individualizable yeah so now let's take it on for a drive so people driving the 2022 m5 competition facelift it has a really comfortable suspension on my car it's way stiffer than this this is why uh, this is because this car has the bmw m8 suspension it has the suspension of the bmw m8 and that's why it's really comfortable it's a new setup bmw have listened to what their customers said and made it way more comfortable so even in the sport plus this is now a comfortable handling car so i will try to get out of this mess here and i'll see you in a second so people tell me in the comments which gauge cluster you prefer this normal one or this track focused one this sport one you can pr put it into track motors by holding down this button and then it will let me activate it and then it will deactivate this screen so you are focused on the track driving only you only have this gauge cluster in front of you and this screen is turned off So tell me which one you prefer in the comments. It's popping and banging a little bit, it's burbling. But I think you can't hear it on camera. But it's got some noticeable burbles to it that you notice in real life. found this little tunnel and after this little tunnel we will jump onto the autobahn just listen to it it had some pops and bangs so now i will see you back on the autobahn So people you're currently joining me inside the new m5 competition and we are driving it i've already set it to the track display we can this is the normal view and i think it's time that we give it full throttle shall we let's put the let's put the gear in the fastest mode and let's go and that's that's already the 120 limit reached So driving the M5 competition LCI 2022 model at night or at the sunset, it's really amazing. Look at these Bowers and Wilkins lighting up, the lighting here, the carbon, the full leather, everything. We've got this track, this track gauge cluster like in M5 CS and the new M3 and basically every new M, but it looks so cool how it goes up because I've seen some people that don't like it, but it's actually pretty pretty cool i prefer it over this normal one look at this normal one uh, this one is really much cooler in my opinion so i will see you back when we get some de-restricted autobahn so people we are now at my sign and let's go one sixty one seventy one eighty this car does not stop pulling two hundred 200 and we need to get a little bit of the gas because there's some traffic in front of us but this car does not stop pulling seriously it's such a joy to drive sheer drive sheer driving pleasure this car okay do we have space now we have absolute space now Let's go. 200, 210, 220, 230, 240, 250, 260, 270, 280. Now we need to break here because someone pulled out. Yeah. So now you will get to see the carbon ceramics. Absolute amazing break for a car like this you just have to have carbon ceramics because they work so good when they are hot whilst the steels they start to fade 
and that's why I would always recommend carbon ceramics on a car like this, this heavy and this fast. So people, we now have some space again and let's go! driving through a curve this car is going 250 through a curve that's how amazing this m5 comp is 270 let's get out the gas a little bit and let's go again 280 290 there's a big curve coming i need to brake unfortunately but that was 290 kilometers per hour this car is so quick and it does it so effortlessly. You don't even care and the car doesn't care. Here are the sport displays, by the way. They show us the new two meters and the power and the oil temperature and the oil, oil pressure. So if I give it full throttle, we have full oil pressure. Look, yes. let's go again. 200, 220. We need a little bit, we need to be a little bit careful here because we don't know what's going on. Oh, and now we need to brake, unfortunately, to 120. Let's show you this carbon ceramics. That's how this car brakes on track performance. That's why you need the carbon ceramics, ladies and gentlemen. I will now turn around and then go full throttle again on the other side. So people, I'm currently turning around and let's see how agile this M5 competition LCI is. unfortunately unfortunately back to 120 but this car is seriously agile I was not talking because I was so focused this car is so agile it's in, a, in such a big sedan where you can fit five people luxus luxurious limousine and you can corner like that this is absolute outstanding seriously it's amazing it's just amazing And it's so calm at these speeds, like 120, you could, ba you could literally drive for hours because it's so calm. As you just saw, it's de-restricted again, so that's my sign. It shifts really aggressive, like it gives you a kick in the neck. here because someone is in our lane but that's no problem for us since we have these amazing carbon ceramic brakes yeah would you please move thanks this is not full throttle by the way as you can see here on the power meters Six to thirty in a little curve here, little corner. Two forty, two fifty, two sixty. It's a little bit full here, I think. No, it's just the parking area. Two sixty, two hundred seventy. here but we still managed to do like 290 and stuff which is amazing if you ask me we have a little tunnel here so let's just break and give it some throttle amazing now back in the city and I will do you a little review how it drives 
and the daily modes. So, massaging seat on and let's relax. 50 kilometers per hour, sixth gear. Car is super comfortable, super quiet. You don't hear anything from the outside, any outside noise. It's seriously like in a super luxury car like the S or 7 series. That's why that's what I love about the M5. Yeah, by the way, heated seats, ventilated seats and basically everything here. Bowers and Wilkins audio which really sound you just have to hear it yourself. It's worth every single penny. And let's just drive a little bit in the city. A little bit of throttle here on this bridge so we hear some sound of this 4.4 V8. I just love this car. So let's try a little launch control, ladies and gentlemen. So do you see off, track mode, launch control. Oh my God. Yeah, this is how 625 horsepower feel when you launch them. So people, I hope you enjoyed this video, leave a like, leave a subscribe and I will see you on the next time, goodbye.